A few months ago, we decided it was time that we moved house. It hasn't happened. But what we did start to do was tidy things because we thought if you're going to be moving, then you need to have things in order. Alas, since we started making a diary of our tidying last summer, things have gone rapidly downhill. So we're going to start again. Let's start the show. Paul, what are you doing? Looking at what my time. Are you getting sweets or something? We're supposed to be tidying up and like sorting stuff. I need something to motivate me. <laughs> Well, it's going to take a lot of motivation. By the time you see this episode, we will have left our house. Um, as I'm speaking right now, it's July 2023 and our rent is about to go up by 22 to 25%, depending on whether um, we're able to get a little bit of a reduction or a massive increase. Um, but we're basically being priced out of the market. And we've been here at this point for seven years, and it looks as though that we're into our last year last coming year. up. So you can imagine over the last seven years, a lot of stuff has accumulated around the house. Uh, I'm not going to show you all the mess, but we have started tidying a few things um, today. And I thought it's best to tackle just one area at a time. So we've been in our sitting room and we've been going through like piles of magazines, or rather Paul has, while I've been like mm. fiddling around editing other episodes. Um, but I just wanted to get the room that we're sitting in the most sort of cleared to a certain degree and cleaned up a bit, so as we're not sitting amongst all the rubbish. We'll give you a little quick look around at where we're at, and it was a lot worse a little bit earlier on today. One of the things I thought we might do is sell some stuff. And I thought this would be a good place to start. No, not my stomach, but this. Can you even make out what it is where all our coats are hanging? Paul, please kindly explain what we've got here. Oh, it's an exercise bike. <laughs> and it never gets used, does it? Um, I think I might have used it up until like about 2021. Well, I think we could get five quid for that. At least. We paid 110. It came from Tesco, but we had it when we lived in Nottingham. Nottingham. Yes, and that was like nine years ago, roughly. So we've had it a long time and it hasn't had a lot of use and it, there isn't really the room in here to keep it. And certainly wherever we end up moving, it's probably going to be a lot smaller than this. So we're not even going to be able to have room for it. So rather than it cluttering everything up, um, I thought, well, let's just get rid of it. We'll clean it up a little bit and stick it on gum tree for a fiver. And you can see that behind the exercise bike, underneath the stairs... Is it my glasses? <laughs> well, boxes full of glasses and other things. I don't really know what's in there. So my, there's quite a lot of stuff to tackle. I have my, um, my back roller thing that I got, which I haven't used. I'm not getting rid of it. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel today and I wanted to remind you to hit the subscribe button for those that, of you that haven't subscribed already and we do also appreciate your likes and comments. It's been two months since the initial clean, and we haven't done anything since. There's quite a state in here, isn't there, Paul? Why do I even have any of this? I'm fed up with this. 
Yeah, there's lots of things lying everywhere. We did actually have a little bit of a tidy up over there earlier today, but it's only because we've got people coming to visit. But you're tackling your pile of magazines and newspapers. There's more over there. I can only do what I can do, but I think, to be honest, why did I rip things out? And I don't think I'm even going to look at it again. So I think I it needs to go into the bin as well. Indeed. Every little counts. Well, we have to start somewhere, Paul. Look, I think a good place to start with this new session of tidying is with this drawer because... I guess in most people's houses, the kitchen drawer kind of becomes a bit of a dumping ground. Mm. But I can't even get to some of the knives in here. So I'm going to go through everything in this drawer to see what I might want to keep. I might want to sort through later or indeed stuff that could be chucked away. Maybe there's stuff in here that's useful that we should actually be using. And um, there's something I see immediately. This pair of scissors broke a while ah, back. Yeah, yeah, it just ripped. Yeah, they they are meat scissors and we've had them for years. We, we never actually bought them. We found them somewhere. Did and yeah. and Do you see, know how it happened? Like I was cutting the back of the chicken and then that bit just came off. Well, you know what? I think we're just going to chuck them. It caught, oh, where's my bin gone? It's gone over here. I'll just put the bin down here. So why don't you say to everyone what you're Oh, well, I've got a bin for chucking, and I've got two boxes. Uh, one is for stuff I'm going to look through later, which will probably be this one. And this one is stuff that is to go back into the drawer, because once we've actually cleared the drawer, we need to clean it as well, because it hasn't been cleaned yeah. for years. Um, we do have new scissors. These are our meat cutting ones, and they're much stronger than the last one. So it's not as if we're going to be short of scissors. So we've got those. And we also have a smaller pair of scissors. Uh, I think they're somewhere else at the moment because we, we, they're quite versatile. Sometimes we use them for cutting wrappers off or sometimes we use them for cutting paper and stuff. Um, ah, look at this. Oh. <laughs> we have had quite a time with tin openers recently. Um, I was opening a tin and the tin opener that I had just snapped. The whole plastic bit just came off. And it's not easy to find this type of tin opener anymore, but we managed to find it at Lower Marsh in a shop called Tool Shop. Um, so that goes in there. We do actually have another one in here somewhere. Yeah, so I always like to have two because in case <laughs> one breaks, then you do have another one. This one's not terribly good. Um, the one that broke was, <laughs> well, I'll say it was the better one. <laughs> Uh, it didn't really last that long. So we've got two tin openers. Who knows? We might actually find more in here. Right, we've got a box of paper straws. Now, I don't think that should actually be in this drawer okay. because this is something we're opening every day. And how often do we actually use straws? Well, why don't you take out the other straws too? Oh, we've right? got yeah, and we also pick up straws sometimes when we go to cafes or McDonald's or something. Um, so we've got like, lots of other straws in here. Look at this. There's one. There's got more. There's more straws. So, oh look, there's a, another paper one. So, oh, another one. Oh, there's more. How many are there? Gosh, look at this. There's another one back here. Oh my gosh. There are probably more as well. We'll find them. <laughs> but they are going to go into this box of like sorting and stuff. And that's a fight. I reckon if we put stuff in here, we might just leave it. <laughs> no, you might as, forget. Yeah, as well as lots of straws, we've got lots of chopsticks that call the. I don't use that up. many chopsticks. I use the ones that I have. Yeah. So can we put these into that box as well? Uh -huh. Look, there's more. And again, we'll probably come across quite a few. All right, they'll go into this sorting box. I use that for wine. Right. Okay. So that'll go back in probably. I use that for wine to aerate and to get the air out. Now these are our um, world sharpest knife pairing knives. They're really good. So they'll definitely be kept. Now this is part of a set for measuring. 
for cups and things. So I don't think it should be in here because it's just sort of, mm. how often do we use it? So that's going to go in, in there. Uh, pizza cutter, yeah, we've got two of those. Definitely using those. Uh, we have a... I don't think that one there. is as good as the other one. This I one. like to use this one that's more sturdy. Yeah, but again, it's something that's, that's in use all the time. Oh now, my what's gosh. What's this, more straws? Are these... Mi what are these? Oh, do no you know idea. what these kids... What are they? I think these are going to be chucked because I don't know what we're going to use them for. No. These came with a kit that I got to make a telescope last year, which was for a children's episode. And these were for some sort of experiment. But I don't even know what they're for. And they're mm, just cluttering red. up. Yeah, so that is going into recycling down there. Now, these are very useful. We have... Uh, they are skewers for... Um, corn on the cob but we also use them for opening things that they're very good for opening packets of bacon and sort of thing, or ham. and also like like the chicken thighs and stuff like that yes yeah, so all those packets of meat so that's good we have got scrapers now look at this this one's not even been used i don't even remember us buying that one you see look at that we've got those they, they go in there. Another bottle opener. Oh. With a, with, with I think lots of bottles. that one this. came from Heineken, this one. Oh, yeah. London Pride. Penis. Phallic, yeah. <laughs> uh, any more? Oh, this is for like... Oh, yes, this is... Tea. Yeah, this is... Yeah, exactly. Look at that. This is for loose tea. We don't even have any loose tea. Um, but we did buy that thinking that we might get some. So I think so, maybe keep it in there. Yeah, it, it should be used. The paintbrush. Oh, that's for like putting on the... Oh, basting. No, that's for like for like the baking stuff when you put like the egg wash. Right, so I would use that. Uh -huh. That'll go there. Oh, look, now these... Those are for chopsticks. You want to, I bet you want to keep these, right? Do you want to put them somewhere? Do you want to put them somewhere we'll else? We'll put them in there, yeah. Oh, another straw. I said, I said I'd get, get more. What's... What? Oh, ah. is that for butter? No, what I think this? that's for like um, orange peel or something. Oh, right. We've never used it. I put it in there. It might be used. Oh, look, another bottle opener. When did we get this? This is from Green King. Oh, okay. I think I got that at one of those job fairs I another went to. Another straw. Another one of these things. Now, these are your wine stops, mm -hmm. right? So you do use those. I do. And we've got more of these um, chopstick, chopstick holders. holders. They go in there. Now, we've got lots of... Um, oh, a these. scissor. Ah, yes. This is for chucking because this is a really old scissor. They're completely blunt. And I, I keep seeing them and thinking... Can I pick them up from work? Yeah, but they're blunt. This old one. They're oh, absolutely geez. blunt. Red. Yeah, they'll go into... Oh, they could be recycling as metal. Oh my gosh, it? there's a key. Oh, what's the key for? See, there's a key in there. I don't even know what the key's for. Right, this is a bottle opener as well. And this is a bottle opener. This is a bottle opener. This came out of a Christmas cracker. So I think, you know, we could use them. I think that it's a, like a, mini, a sign. <laughs> mini whisk. And another bottle opener. Oh. So there's nails and things in here too. Now you might be saying, why have you got all these um, plastic elastic bands? Um, we do use them. Yeah, and this is like a, a bracelet thing. But they are actually good for wrapping cables. up cables. Yes, so we will be keeping all these. But I think rather than them all sitting in here, we need to find somewhere for them. Um, so we'll pick those out after we do this. These are toothpicks. And you do use those, don't you, Paul? For picking out bits oh, of stuff. Oh, these things. These things are, are the things that I get with rice cakes. And it's good to, like, tie up um, loaves of bread. Oh, right. These things. Okay. So what about the toothpicks? Do you think they should go somewhere? You could chuck them. Chuck them? No, no, no. Oh, but you because use we could these. use them for like an episode or something. Yeah, but you use them. 
And these th th these are like burger skewers, right? Yeah. So. And this oh this was from a children's episode. This was we could use that as a toothpick, I suppose. I don't want to chuck out things that might be used, I suppose. Burger skewers. Uh, another bottle opener. Another one. ESB fillers. Yeah. More toothpicks and more burger skewers. But I don't know what this doesn't look that good, does it? Okay, get rid of Should we just get rid of the these ones. Okay. Yeah? Uh. Okay. Okay. Into the recycling. Okay, we will continue doing this bit and then we'll tackle the rest of the drawers in a moment. Hello. Oh, yes, it's Paul and Marcus on YouTube. And we're back. Look, we also found screws and nails. I don't, well, one nail. I don't and know. also that key. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing in here. Right, we're going to tackle the cutlery bits now. But look, first of all, there's another one of those scrapers. And Isn't another that brush. like a peeler? A peeler, sorry, yeah. And another brush, look. Now, I do have some of these plastic spoons and knives and things. Um, I take them into work. Um, I do have a bag for them down here. So I Which think, I think we'll have to go through so. Yeah, but I think, well, oh look, see, they're just falling out. I think, yeah, but that drawer's for another day. I'm going to tackle one drawer at a time, my dear. <laughs> so I think I'm going to put all these plastic and wooden spoons um, into this bag. Because, because it, it does take up space. Yeah, it? and it's just getting all mixed up with everything else. So... We've the got, chopsticks together. You've got your chopsticks. These are ones that are in use. Uh, well, actually, look. There's another packet of them. Oh, more. Oh, okay. my gosh. So heck do we get Chopsticks, on? they'll go in here. Again, we'll have to sort all this out um, afterwards. But look, there's like skewers, another elastic band. This is like a stirrer, another straw, more chopsticks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like another... What's that called? More straws. Toothpick. Yeah. Gosh, and it, all these things are mixed together. So no wonder we can't find stuff when we're actually looking for it. There's like a weird lid of something. Oh, That's do you know what that what that is? Oh, is it for this? For the oven? Mm. Oh, it broke off. Ah, well, we better keep that. We'll keep it. It's not going to go on. Uh, it broke. No. But we'll, we'll, we'll return it when we leave. As this episode is partly about moving house. Uh, okay, more chopsticks. So we'll just lift all these out. These are our dessert spoons, soup spoons, all that sort of stuff. Look, this one's dirty. Chopsticks. Whatever. That needs to go back into the into the wash. So these can go in here, and that goes in here, and these go in here. Right, fork. Oh, I was going to say, this this one's got nothing else, but it does have one of these stirrers. And if we can move that ribbon out of the way. That's like for Christmas. Yeah, we'll now go into the teaspoon drawer. We've actually got quite a collection of teaspoons that we have picked up from various oh places over the years. I don't think I've ever bought, I might have bought one or two. We did but, buy, didn't we win one like in a competition? Uh, yes, we did. At one of what those gay bars. Yeah. But we've also gained some in, um, a friend gave us some from a friend of his who died. So we have got those and it's good that things are being put into use. But there are stirrers amongst the teaspoons. But there we go. I go in there. And the knives. Let's see. Oh, goodness. Oh, Look at this. There's bits of string and everything. Oh, I can't get hold of stuff. <laughs> Look! Oh my god. So, let's try to rescue the knives. Shouldn't we stuff. get rid of the string? Come on, oh. oh my god. Dear. Ow! Ow! It's cutting into me. 
Shall we just check this string or do you no. want it? No. Okay. Uh, well, it, should ah. go, it needs to go into the Christmas box. Why was it not there in the first place? Look! This is More? A, yeah, this is like a new set. Look, it's not even been opened. Ooh. Oh! Oh, it joins together. That's why, look. Ah. Look. Is it is like it? a double-edged one or something? A double-edged sword. <laughs> But I don't think we're going to be using all, all those. I'll go in here. Uh, oh, look, another little thingy and another knife. Now we've got a tape measure here. That'll come in handy. Yeah, but again, what's it doing in there? Okay. Uh, another one of these things, which we're not keeping. Okay. Oh, these I could tie onto my suitcases. Right. We've got a spoon for coffee. Uh, Should we leave it out, or do you want to leave I'll it? I'll put it in there, I think. We've got like a, we've got a yo-yo. Are we keeping this? No. No. <laughs> so what I'm going to do... Trash? There we go. Yeah, recycling and trash. Oh, there's stuff on the floor now. Look at this. Oh, oh my dear. This is a filter, a spare filter for the coffee machine. So it's, Don't throw it out. Yeah, I'm not going to throw it out, my dear. So we'll just put it back into its little pouch. And I kept this because I liked the New York thing. But why is it in this drawer? It's because it was a dumping ground for everything. Look at that. There's a label from something. Right. What have we got now? Oh, this is your sharpening tool, my dear. Yeah, I think leave it in here for now. You haven't used this recently. It's the sharpened knives. I think one of my cleavers is really dull. Oh, right. Well, you don't want to have a dull cleaver, my dear. I think we need an extra box, don't you? Because we've got stuff which is like almost like Christmassy. You could throw those out. Yeah, I don't know why we're keeping these odds and ends. What about the ribbons? No. Get rid of the ribbons too? Yes. We have a lid for what? a jam jar. There's another one there. There's just like a little no. American Airlines pouch or no, something. No, that's red. And another one of these weird things. So okay, fine. Recycling, rubbish. Let's see. Oh, this is very useful. This is our ah. temperature thing for meat. Oh, what's that chopsticks again? See, there's this back bit as well. <laughs> oh, look, there's extra knives. Is this a serrated one? Oh, no. What's that? Surgical know. stainless steel. Oh, it's for cutting lemons. Oh, that would have come in handy. Oh, this when was from, did we get these? This was from a wedding, and these are bottle openers as well. But I don't think they're in everyday no. use. We're not chucking them, but uh, no, no. What's that? Cookie? Yeah, this is like cookie cutters. Mm. More, what do you call those things? Lids? That's a gingerbread, man. And there's something which I can't get out because look, this is... Oh, this whole thing will come out. <gasps> so we're putting the knives safely over here. And there's something in there, but I can't get it. Oh, I think it is. Do you know what it is? It's out of a... Is it out of a Christmas crack? Oh, no, it's not. It's got a screw. Isn't that light that we hung up? Oh, should we keep it? I don't know what it is. But it looks like one of these like spinners. Look, it doesn't spin. Uh, okay, what is this? Another bottle opener. Another bottle opener. Oh, from Green King. Oh, and this I was think it from Greece. When I went to one of those job fairs. Right. Oh, put it in there. I kept this for something. Oh, that's for like salt. Oh. Do you remember we got them like in Greece or something? Wait a minute. Is this another? Did I just put it back in there? I think we got them like in a cracker or something. Oh, right. Okay, all in there. Ice cream scoop. We'll be needing that, I'm sure. What's this John Lewis user manual for the... Well, we don't need a manual to use the cafeteria. No. So why on earth did we keep that? I don't know. That shouldn't be in there. That is extra hooks for a shower. Oh, look. Right, I can put those... More nails. Yeah, so I can put those in. Actually, I might keep this thing then. They could go in there too. 
Ah, this is our... Oh, the, for the pancake thing. The, yeah, for ma for making the um, fortune cookies. It's a silicone mat. But again, it's not everyday use. Very rarely we use it, so it can go in there. I see more chopsticks under there. Oh, did you keep your string? Why don't you leave them to the side and I'll sort it out later. Right, that's for the Christmas box. And these things we're not keeping. Look, look at this. Another bottle opener, but not for everyday use. Uh, more cookie cutters. There's like a Guinness thing. Over there. there are more. How many tops do you know. need? I don't even know why no, I want to keep that. that. Okay, so that's for trash. Uh, no. Why do we keep this? I think I kept it for the ribbon, but I don't need it. No. Oh, well, we'll keep, no, but this, this, this is useful for tying things up. Don't need that. Don't need that. No. Don't need the Guinness thing, I don't think, do we? No, I don't, no. Or should we keep it just in case? We for St. Patrick's Day. Yeah. Do you want to keep all the other... The Guinness things, you never know, it might come in handy. Well, sometimes I use them for, um, um, bookmarks. Later. <laughs> my... More chopsticks. My spoons are there, too. Why are there... How many chopsticks can you use? You, do you even use these... These soup spoons anymore. Do you want to put them in there anyway? I don't know. Okay. But what about all these chops, extra chopsticks? These are over in another section, so they're not even used. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Get a storehouse exclusive. I don't think I need that. No. No. Right. And another measuring thing oh this is to put on a shoe so why is it in here oh a tape measure dear. another tape measure yeah the the white one. ah this one this is actually quite useful yeah so we'll keep that these can go in here what's this tap inserts oh is this what we got yeah we're not using this this didn't work why do you want to chuck it? Yeah, this did not work. Check back our tips and tricks episode a while back. Pliers, now they shouldn't be in there. They should. Oh my be... god, I was looking for those. Yeah, I could tip my tooth out with this. Can we right. not? Uh, this broke off something that belongs to the house, and another one of these. What is that? And look, all these bits and bits of plastic and stuff. I don't even know what that is. That's not going to be used for anything. It's just like little odds and ends of plastic. And are we really going to be using these... No. ...forks for chips? No. I don't think so. And more lids. I think we get rid of the lids. There's another one of these things. Did it come yeah, with the house? Yeah, it came off something to do with the house. I don't know what. Well, it's not going to be put back, is it? <laughs> no. Oh, this was a... Under... For the mouse. Oh, right. Leave that out. Was this thing for the mint oil or something? Yeah, it might have been. I remember I bought that dropper. Um, oh, no, for your... It was for, my, for the yeah. clove oil. Actually, Maybe you should yeah, keep I'll, it. Take it, I'll take it upstairs to put with my clove oil. And that was the last thing that I bought at Boots before the pandemic. I remember. What's this... A... This is broken off oh, the freezer. The freezer. Do you want to keep this? Yeah, we should probably like... Although the freezer is not really part of the overall stuff to do with the flat anymore. The house, I mean. So Because they say that if something goes wrong with the free fridge freezer, it won't be replaced. So I don't think it's under normal rules. This is... Um... Uh, bookmark. Right. Oh dear, my dear. This is so stressful. We're nearly there. Do you want to do another drawer after this? <laughs> no. Oh, look. I love Cypress. Oh, we should put it up. Yeah, that'll go in the fridge. There's a thermometer there. There's like more screws and stuff. A thermometer, my dear. Yeah, I see it amongst the toothpicks. Like there's a little mini... Oh, those toothpicks over there. A toothbrush. That's not a toothbrush. It's a paintbrush. No, those things. Oh, look. San Marino, another weird thing. Another key. Oh, this this thermometer. 
Oh, we can use that to stick up on the wall. Another chopstick. Another Guinness, which I'll keep. These are sticky pads that we use for sticking up um, hooks on the wall. So they are of use. And what's this? A magnet again. Oh, that's from... We don't need these ice cream things. Dang it. Oh, right. Okay, so I think we're almost there. Another one of these. I'd love to know what that is. I have absolutely no idea what that is. There's another one. There's white ones and... What's the other colour? Black? That's bizarre. Right, okay. Do you think it has something to do with our old... um? cabinet that we used to have the thing for the tv ah yes so actually why are we keeping them i don't know should we get rid of those this was like the old key for that cool key for something else. don't let the viewers know what it is right we're nearly there ah i see look these are used for hooks mm. yes an empty bag there's like this a mini clothes tag. Yeah. I, see that. <laughs> I think it came off. We had mini clothes pegs for the Christmas, Christmas cards. cards. Yeah. For putting up Christmas cards. Another elastic band. And we're nearly there. Um, more screws. And rowel plugs and things. Oh my gosh. And these things that came off like Christmas crackers or shirts or something. There's a little mini screw. Should we just get rid of them? I think there's no point in keeping these things. Okay. I, I don't even know what they're for. If you don't know what it is, then why are you keeping it? Right. Mm. I mean, this came with something, but I don't know. We'll keep the key. You might find it. It opens something worth lots of money. Another one of your little hooky things. Oh, just a piece of plastic. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that is. So that'll be for recycling. Right, okay. We are almost there. Oh, this is... So we have lots of um, toothpicks. What's this? This was this came off a shirt. Why have we got... Let me get rid of it. I don't know why we're keeping this. Right. So is it only the toothpicks that remain now? Yeah. And you had lots of toothpicks. Where are they? They're, they're here. So we could actually find like a jar, perhaps. Or maybe them. put it... Oh, I think we have some jars underneath this drawer. Well, you can leave them up there for now. Yeah, so you're going to sort all this while I edit. Oh, gosh. Now, there's one more thing we need to do. Because I think this entire unit comes out. Look, this is where the knives have been. And you can see... Yeah, it's that made that's a hole. What, it's made a hole. Yeah. It's made a whole lot of space. Okay. Everything sorted. Let's lift this out. If it does come out. Will it come out? Yeah. <gasps> and more stuff inside. What is this? I don't know what that is. Oh. Right. Okay. Well, we're there. This now needs to be cleaned. Well, I think that's as far as we're going to get today. Paul's going to start cleaning this, but in the meantime, if you like today's show, then perhaps you would like to consider subscribing for more. And if you have a comment to leave, please do that and give us a thumbs up as well. And we will see you next time. Oh, and wait, something else. What did I forget? Don't forget to buy us a coffee. Oh, if, yes, I need one after please, this. Please, I need caffeine. Uh, details below now.